Thank you. Uh, the next question is, uh, Tesla recently decided not to produce standard range version of Model Y, no longer offers, uh, offers a standard range Model S or X, and has announced ramping of the semi. Does this shift from smaller pack vehicles suggest that Tesla is not battery constrained as in the past? What are the biggest constraints now? Well, I'd just like to reemphasize, you know, any mining companies out there, please mine more nickel. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wherever you are in the world, please mine more nickel and, and, and don't wait for nickel to go back to some long, some high point that you experienced some five years ago or whatever. Go for efficient, you know, as environmentally friendly nickel mining at high volume. If Tesla will give you a con giant contract for a long period of time, <laughs> if you mine nickel efficiently and in, in an environmentally sensitive way. So, hopefully this message goes out to all mining companies, uh, please get nickel. <laughs> um, with, re with regard to passenger vehicles, uh, I, th I think the new normal for range is going to be, just in U.S. EPA terms, uh, you know, approximately 300 miles. So, I think people will really come to expect that as... Um, you know, some number close to 300 miles as as normal. You know, that that that's a standard expectation. Um, uh, because you do need to take into account, like, you know, is it very hot outside or very cold, or you know, do, are you driving up a tall mountain um, with with a full load, uh, and and it's a uh, you know, people don't want to have a you know get get to the destination with like. Uh, 10 miles range. They, they want some reasonable, reasonable margin. So I think 300 is going to be really, or well, close to 300 is going to be a new normal. Yeah, call it 500 kilometers, basically. Um, and on the insurance front, I want to be clear, we're, we're building a great, like a major insurance company. Um, if you're interested in revolutionary insurance, please join Tesla. I, I would love to have some high energy actuaries, especially I have great respect for the actuarial profession. Uh, your guys are great at math. Uh, please join Tesla, especially if you want to change things <laughs> and you're annoyed by how slow the, the industry is. This is the place to be. We want, we want revolutionary actuaries. <laughs>